What's up guys? It's your favorite fellow Earthling here, Austin Lee Hires. Thanks for joining in on my channel once again. If you haven't subscribed yet, go ahead and subscribe down below because I'll keep asking you until you do. Today's video is not going to be very long because it is my wife and I's sixth anniversary. We're going out tonight for dinner. We're going to have a lot of fun. Most of you may know I give prizes away every Friday on my channel and if you don't know, now you do. Go to my video every Monday, comment the keyword down below and I'll have a prize for you to win. This week is a $5 bill and the winner of the prize is right here. Thanks to this person for commenting on my channel, watching my videos. We've given away over five prizes on this channel so far and we're gonna keep doing it every single week. Every single week, yeah! So if you didn't get a chance to win this $5 bill, make sure you watch every video on Monday that I put out. Hit that notifications bell so you don't miss my Monday videos because those are the most important if you're looking to win prizes on this channel. This $5 is probably worth a lot more than $5, just saying. What we're doing is basically selling the big red truck so we can get my wife more of a family vehicle to drive to and from wherever she may go. And at the same time, we're gonna have a little extra money for our new endeavor we're going on. If you guys wanna see what business I'm opening up, you have to go back to one of my last live shows and watch that. I'm not gonna go ahead and tell it to everybody on here because it is that awesome. You and me and everybody else that is part of this channel Let's hustle this year. Let's make that money. The housing market is supposedly supposed to be going down and it's gonna be a struggle this year. So make sure that you're getting on your hustle. You wanna know why I went and bought things off of Facebook so that I could resell them on eBay? Even though I'm making 250,000 a year in my junk removal business, I have an Airbnb that's gonna make me about 12,000 this year projected, maybe even more. Point being, I have a lot of other streams of income and I'm still going on Facebook every morning finding some good deals to flip on eBay and then making extra money from that because I'm a hustler and I'm gonna keep hustling until I hit a million dollars. Yo, let's do this. Let's do this, let's go. All of you, everybody watching this, you gotta look like a million bucks. You gotta act like a million bucks. You gotta smell like a million bucks. You gotta feel like a million bucks. You have to believe in a million bucks. One milli, one milli, one milli, illi, illi. One milli, one milli, one milli, illi, illi. One milli, one milli, one milli, illi, illi. One milli, one milli, one milli, illi. Let's go see my beautiful truck. Richard, Isaac, and I cleaned this truck up yesterday. We put a little bit of wax on her to make her shine. You know what I'm saying? But well, we're gonna have to get rid of this thing. This truck literally started my business, guys. I don't know why I bought this truck to start my business, but this truck made me a lot of money. I bought it probably because I was young and dumb and I really just wanted to get a lifted truck and be a cool guy. Woo, that, that was not a smart decision because this truck had so many problems because of the lift kit and hauling so much weight. I'm sure a lot of you on here know about that already, but for those of you that don't, never get a lift kit to haul heavy weight. It's something I had to learn. I'm not ashamed of it. It's still a sexy truck. Basically, these tires here cost $2,000 every time I had to replace them. And uh, yeah, that was a pretty penny. Also, the front end, I had several times, I had the front end uh, have problems with the U-joints, with the AR, uh, with the A-arms uh, because of the fact that there's so much weight and the turning radius on this thing sucks and then turning these giant tires with the stock uh, they have a stock steering box in there so it's not like a heavy-duty steering box or anything like that 
I had to check and see if my mic was still on, and it is, we're still rolling. If you guys can see the bumper right here is actually, uh, where, where am I at? So the bumper right here is actually like bent upwards. That's because this tire actually caved in at one point. We were luckily pulling into the yard and then the tire just snapped off. The truck dropped and I couldn't move anywhere. I had to pay $100 just to get the truck towed like 10 feet from, from the bottom of the road there up here in my yard. As it was ridiculous. So yeah, this truck has cost me a lot of money, but it also made me a lot of money, guys. And I'm gonna go ahead and sell it. I have it up for about 14,000, and I have someone that is gonna is willing to pay 12,5 for it. So I may sell it very soon here. But it came with leather interior, uh, has a sunroof. It's got the the Bose speaker in here. I mean, this thing was the top, the top of the top of 2007 uh, Chevys. 3500 has the Allison transmission. I mean, this truck is my baby. And that's why I wanted to make this video today so I can go back in the future and uh, look at this video and like, be like, oh, why'd I sell it? <laughs> oh man, but it's really still in good condition and I don't want to get rid of it. But sometimes in life, you have to make hard choices. That's the point of the video today. Sometimes in life, you guys have to make hard choices on selling stuff or getting rid of something that you really like or doing something that you don't want to do uh there you just have to you have to do stuff sometimes it is not a smart choice for me to keep holding on to this truck and my wife's spending the diesel gas prices even though gas prices are on the rise and probably going to catch up soon if not surpass uh, but yeah, we, we want to get a family car, the, the truck, the tires alone uh, will save us so much money every year because we have to get re those replaced every year. So that's enough for my rambling, guys. I just wanted to make the short video and let you guys know, don't be afraid to make those choices. You know, those gut-wrenching choices that you know you have to make, but you're afraid to make. Just jump on it. Make those choices. Do what you have to do. Take those risks get out there and make that money that's the only way to do it you have to get out there and start <sighs> look how big he's getting huh my big fluff ball is it my big fluff ball are you my big fluff ball boy huh? all right he doesn't want no lovings right now but he's getting huge i'm about to spend the rest of the day with the love of my life and we get a break from the children for a little while, so I can't wait to, to go ahead and do this. I'm gonna edit this video, post it, and I'm out of here. Thanks, guys. I'll let the Austin from the past take us away. Well, I guess that's the end of the video, guys. I told you it wasn't gonna be that long. I thank you for sticking around and watching my videos. Hit that like button, that subscribe if you haven't already. We'll see you later.